The government has today announced a raft of measures including reinspection of all public service vehicles and retesting of PSV drivers in 14 days. The Roads and uh, Transport Cabinet Secretary Kipchumba Murkomen says identified road black spot areas will be dualed. The CS says there will be harsh punishment for those caught violating traffic rules as Ayub Abdikadio now reports. In a hastily organized news conference, Amidst a deep national disquiet over the growing number of road fatalities, CS Murkomen flanked by Interior PS Dr. Raymond Omolo and the Inspector General of Police Jafet Kome announced measures they presented as fit to curb road accidents. All PSV, PSVs, seven-seater and above, and commercial vehicles with tear weight of 3,048 and above be presented for compliance checks with the relevant speed limiter vendors within 30 days, failure to which all NTSA issued license will be invalidated. The government has come under intense public pressure over the deaths on the roads. Murkomen additionally announcing actions he said will lessen the cases of road accidents. If we find you are in a motor vehicle carrying 14, or PSV vehicle carrying 14 people, and you are forcing yourself to sit on one seat with somebody else, you will be charged. The Cabinet Secretary for Roads and Transport also announced the deployment of Joint Traffic Police and the National Transport and Safety Authority officials to enforce traffic rules. Passengers themselves will be charged. If we find you are in a motor vehicle carrying 14, or PSV vehicle carrying 14 people, and you are forcing yourself to sit on one seat with somebody else, you will be charged. Come who was present, urged the police officials to take action against anyone in violation of the law. I will not intervene. You'll be arrested, go to court, go to jail, or you'll be fined every day. The government has also announced new rules for schools. School transport and vehicles carrying children are restricted to operate between 6 a.m. and 7 p.m. And I, re I repeat, we restrict not just school transport vehicles, but also vehicles that are carrying children to operate between, uh, uh, school children to operate between 6 a.m. and 6, 7 p.m. According to the National Transport and Safety Authority, since the year began, more than 7,000 Kenyans have been involved in road accidents, marking an increase of 1,909 Kenyans have died from road accidents, 3,316 seriously injured, and more than 2,600 suffering from minor injuries. Asante, Ayub Abdikadir, Citizen TV.